Okay. We're back to the stupid pocket dimension, which murdered me for no reason last time. I literally was just standing in place and all of a sudden I fell. And you might say that the boulder... Oh, I'm back. That the boulder pushed me off. But if you actually... If you even touch the boulder, then you immediately die and you hear a crack sound. So it couldn't have been that. Okay. Wait, where are we in terms of the maintenance tunnel? I think... Wow, wait. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Did 17... No, not 17... Did 106 just put me exactly where I need to be and let me skip both tunnels? So... 106 was never actually after me at all. Maybe he wants me to escape because he knows I'm going to choose the gate A ending, which is the only way in which he can escape. Maybe he knows we're on mutual grounds and that finally we can form a covalent relationship that will allow us to both live, even though we both made our tragic end and we die next to each other, firmly holding hands. It's quite beautiful, actually. Although, sadly, that isn't the case, because he's tried to murder me on several occasions. Oh well, one can dream. Perhaps 106 doesn't hate at all. Perhaps he just wants to help the world, and all those who live in it. Okay. Oh! Thank you, Zero! Thank you, 079, for closing this. Okay, I was waiting for him because I need to hear the footsteps of the MTF. Which might spawn this time, actually. If they do, I don't know what I'm going to do. Because this is the only way to go. I don't hear them. Okay, I don't hear them. Luckily, this time, I don't have to worry about finding the electric place. Oh. Oh. This is one of the few safe havens in the game. Ah, hello, my beautiful 294. Hello. Hello. Um, can you give me a cup of hope? A cup of hope. No, you can't. Oh. Give me a cup of... Um... A cup of... <laughs> cup of cup. Give me a cup of cup. Thank you. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Cup of cup. We will cherish this, even though it's nothing. Yay. There is nothing to drink in the cup. We will keep the cup forever. Actually, let's have some empty cup. No. Cup. No. We're not going to keep this forever. However, I'll keep... What is this? Orange juice! We're going to keep this orange juice with us at all times. <clears throat> Sorry about that. I make weird noises sometimes for no particular reason. I don't know why. Maybe we all do it. Maybe I'm just weird. Let's pick up some weed. I'm uh, not weed. 420J, of course. Thank you for the level 5. Why does the level 5 keycard appear after you have the level 5 keycard? Seems a bit... Well, it seems a bit silly, if I may so so myself. Um... Uh... Do I want to go down there? I don't particularly want to go down there, but I may have to. No one in here. <laughs> What's a level 2 doing here? Oh, ugh. Okay, we're back. Well, we're, we haven't come here before. 
Oh, I, I was here in the last playthrough, and this should open automatically. And... Oh. Oh. I heard door opening. And I hear 106 in there. Like, he's not in there, but I hear his breathing. I also heard another door open over here. But I may be hearing. Oh shoot! That was an MTF. He's walking into the wall, isn't he? Um... He's walking into the wall. We have to make a run for it. We have no choice! Run, you douche! And we have to go straight where 173 likes to play. I hear them, but I don't see them. And this is a spawn point for once. No. Um, can I go through there? Will I run into another one of them? <sighs> this is why I hate them. They can walk into walls and it makes you think that they're chasing you, but they're not. Okay, that means I'm hidden from them, but they're still looking. But now that I've been seen once, that means from here on out, they'll shoot me on sight. Like, the very first time that they see you... <sighs> they're bugging out again. Run! Run for it. Run! SHOOT! What am I supposed to do? They're just walking into walls. I can't... I can't go either way. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do about that? I can't lure them away by any means. And crouching doesn't really help unless you hide behind a door first. Ugh. What am I supposed to do? I don't even have a ballistics vest. Cup of orange juice, save me, help me. Crouching going up the stairs takes a while. Can't imagine it taking this long in real life, but... Is the door open at least? I can't tell. And I feel like 173 is just gonna come out of nowhere and murder me. Actually, if 173 came, like right now, but didn't kill me, that would help me a lot, because 173 causes them to be distracted for a while. <sighs> They're just bucking out, blocking my only path to sanity. Salvation. Conquest. Okay, let's run this way. There's nothing here. I don't want to save here because I don't want to be saved in a spot where I can't get out of. But I don't want to have to go all that... Okay. We're going to have to make a run for it. 
Run! Oh. That wasn't even fair. Terminated by nine tail fox. Oh. I don't even know where I saved. I bet it was some ridiculous spot that I'll never be able to escape from, though. Some diabolical hell, I'm sure. But, this is why I hate them. And apparently, there are no sudden plans, or near future plans, to make their AI to a point where it doesn't suck. So, that's... That, that's just terrible. And something is visible. I'm pretty sure it's a key card. Okay. Also, is it me? Or did that MTF just sort of spawn there? Because the door was closed. And he... Ugh. Run. Where is he? <clears throat> I don't see douche. I hear douche, but I don't see douche. Is he over here? Oh, oh. I guess I can go back this way. But I didn't want to run into that other mobile task force. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, you there? I can't tell. You can't see very far, but they can see further than you. Well, at least you got to see them, finally. I'm probably going to make this a pretty long part. Gate B. Well, that's not going to be of use to us, because we're going for gate A. Oh, 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 oh. Trying to... Strafe, I know it's... <gasps> Gate A! Gate A! Oh, 106, we made it. Oh, you'll see why I'm thinking 106 in a second. Hello, 990. Oh, I fell out of the elevator, apparently. Alright, check out this. This is actually pretty awesome. Look at him. Oh no, 106. What am I ever going to do about him? Wait, he's not coming to me? What? <laughs> oh boy, this is actually my favorite ending. Because... It's not good or bad. It's probably more bad than good. But this is the only place... Okay, watch this. Watch it! Oh! Oh! They fired some electromagnetic beam at it, or something or another, which actually stopped it. FREEDOM! Yay! Freedom! A Class D has finally penetrated the defenses! <gasps> what? You know too much to let them get you. You're coming with us. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, it's the most questionable one of all, the endings. Okay. This has been the 
second series of me playing SCP Containment Breach. I hope you had uh, as much fun as I did, because this was much more eventful. And, and to be honest, it actually, you know, it wasn't too terrible. I mean, there were a lot of bugs, sure, but, you know, that, that'll happen in any SCP Containment Breach playthrough. But, we did it. It didn't hinder us from completing the game. And, we did it. We, we win. I mean, sure, we had to use console commands quite a few times simply because, you know, bugs kept preventing our progress. But, overall, I really, really did like this game. Like, this playthrough. It was probably the most fun I've had with this in a while. So thank you all so much for watching. Like if you like what you see. Comment if you want to comment. And subscribe if you want to see more videos similar to this one. See y'all. Have a good night.